Here in West Oakland, it is a huge issue with climate change and sea level rise. It not only has an economic impact due to the Port of Oakland, but it also will have an impact on the people who live here and the plants and animals who depend on this area for their ecosystem. Let's talk about the impacts we're expecting for sea level rise here in Oakland. Oakland, in particular West Oakland, is really where our port is located. We also have the Bay Bridge and the touchdown, at least on the eastern side. We have a wastewater treatment facility. We have communities that live here, many of whom are low-income communities or communities of color that are especially vulnerable to sea level rise and to flooding. It's significant amounts of, of rise, um, and it'll affect different parts of Oakland differently. There are some areas that are more low-lying that'll be directly impacted, others that, that won't be. But it's about one to two feet to mid-century, and then three and a half to seven feet by the end of the century. When there are storm surges, there will be other episodic events where we will see the waters go even higher and then combine that with periods when we have these heavy rainfall events, when we get our atmospheric rivers, where you have a lot of water coming off the land that wants to go in the bay. The Bay Bridge, and in particular the newest addition on the east side, that's, that's a relatively new construction, but sea level rise was not integrated into the planning for that. And so there are a number of low points that would be flooded, in some cases permanently flooded, with even just three feet of, of rise. There are a lot of issues, I think, when we think about sea level rise, and it really requires a lot of different groups to come together to begin planning and preparing for it.